Hey guys, it's Julie from Rowan Co. Farms. Brought you guys along for our Azure Standard monthly uh, bulk food pickup. Uh, we order food every month, every other month, from a company called Azure Standard. Um, I'll leave a link down below in the show notes. Um, but it's a bulk food ordering co-op so that you can order large quantities of items like organic flours, sugars, anything household that you can think of that you would like to order in bulk, but also natural organic items uh, you can order from this company. And um, you basically place an order and then once a month there'll be a shipment that comes close to you in, one of, in your area. You have to find the closest drop point to you. And then you um, you meet the truck at that drop point and you pick up your order. So you basically save a ton of money in shipping because sometimes you're ordering several hundred pounds of food. And so if you have that shipped through normal shipping services, you're gonna pay a lot of money for shipping. And so you're saving that money. You're shipping, uh, you're splitting the shipping cost between all of the members of the group, um, which really brings the cost down. And so it's been worth it for us and our family to order from Azure Standard for the last 10 years or so. Um, we don't always order every month. Sometimes there's like a six month gap in between the times we order because we, we get enough stuff uh, that we don't need to go all the time. So um, we're gonna pick up a good bit of things today. Um, probably about 200 pounds of items uh, that we ordered. Some flowers, some sugar, some nuts, dried fruits. Um, a few household items, uh, things like that. Um, we'll go through the whole thing when we get uh, when we get home later. But I just wanted you guys to come along uh, to see what we're getting. Hey guys, it's Julie. Welcome back to Row & Co. Farms. I'm going to show you guys my bulk food order that I got from Azure Standard. I got a nice little load of stuff. Didn't know if you were curious as to what I got, and so I'm going to show you. If you like it, keep watching. If you don't want to see it, hang up. We get a lot of dried fruits, like raisins, golden raisins. We love these. They're non-GMO. This is five pounds and it's way cheaper than buying them at the grocery store. Another five pounds of cranberries. These are um, non-GMO organic, not organic, non-GMO. Also got an assortment of flowers. Um, these are all gluten-free flowers. I recently found out that I cannot have gluten and so I had to get a whole assortment of different things that will accommodate some gluten-free style baking and uh, different things like that. So that's the reason for all these new baking mixes. So this is just a general one-to-one -one baking flour. Great for like cookies and things like that. I got a few bags of that. Um, this is a bread mix. Uh, non-dairy also, which I can't have dairy either, so uh, another option for me. I'm gonna try that. I've never used that before. I haven't been really happy with many of the gluten-free breads that I found, and I like bread. So, uh, next here, I got a yellow corn masa. I'm gonna be making some of my own corn tortillas. I really love corn tortillas, and since I can't have gluten again, this is a good option for me. Um, this is a five pound bag and I got three pounds, uh, three bags of that, so 15 pounds. And that should last me for quite a while, even with making tortillas all the time. All right, next thing is, um, these are uh, raw hazelnuts. Uh, we usually eat a lot of these. I like these better than like a peanut or something like that. So hazelnuts and almonds are a big hit around here. So we got, this is a one, no, two pound bag. You can get all different sizes from them. Okay, next up, 
This is buckwheat flour. Again, a gluten-free gluten <laughs> item that I can use for some baking options. Um, I did skip this over here. So this is Celtic sea salt. It's really nice. It's actually kind of in a, a brine, like a salty sea salt brine. So it's, it's, really, it's a really good mineral-based salt. So you get some good stuff in that rather than just a regular table salt. My dogs, just a minute. <laughs> Sorry about that. My dogs decided something needed attention outside. All right, so next up, this is just organic mustard powder. I'm gonna be trying to make some of my own mustard and I have mustard seeds and also have mustard powder now so I can, I can do that for myself. Um, Next is some dried mangoes. Again, we like dried fruits. Um, same with our raisins and cranberries. So we add this to, you know, cereals, oatmeals, and, you know, trail mixes. Um, here we have five pounds of semi-sweet chocolate chips. These are all like allergen free. There's no dairy in here, so I can't have dairy. So um, these are great. We can make our cookies and stuff with that. Um, next up, maybe I did these two already, is this potato starch and tapioca starch. These are both, again, additives for some gluten-free uh, baking and things like that. And also for making some of the um, vegan cheeses. All right, next up, let's move over this way a little bit. We have... Um, cashew pieces so great for you know just raw eating and trail mixes and things like that but also I'm going to use that to try to make some of those um, vegan cheeses uh, they are usually done with cashews okay. again something else for gluten-free baking brown rice flour um, I'm just I'm, I like to have different options on hand so when I come across a recipe that calls for these different things, I'll have a little bit um, to use for those. All right, so then we have some hazelnut milk. Again, I can't have dairy. This is all new to me, um, the dairy and stuff like that. So I'm trying to figure out what I like and I'm gonna try hazelnut milk because hazelnuts are my favorite of all of them. So we're gonna see, hopefully this is good. All right, then last but not least, we have some apples. Um, some onions, organic onions, again, organic apples, organic carrots, which are right down there. So I've got 10 pounds of each of those um, to get us through the next few months until we start getting some of our fresh produce from the garden again. Um, now in the front here, I have some household items that we like to get, well, supplements and things. So this is collagen. This is a plant-based collagen. Um, I can't have any um, other kinds of collagen, so I'm gonna be using this kind now. Um, and then just a couple of small um, essential oils that we like to have, and I wanted to add to my collection, cypress and lime, some ones that I don't have currently. And then just some jojoba oil and sweet almond oil um, for making, you know, cosmetic items and different things like that. All right, then we have some wax paper bags. And I like to use uh, when I pack my daughter's lunch uh, for school uh, for sandwiches and stuff. Um, this is a canning funnel, which I'm sure most of you guys are familiar with. Um, it's just a metal stainless steel one. I've had a plastic one for all these years and it was time to upgrade, so nice. I got some cheesecloth just for general purposes, <laughs> um, you know, straining yogurt and things like that. And then last but not least, the final thing. No, I have one more final thing after this final thing. These are some beeswax candles. I just like beeswax candles. They're just nice and they smell like bees. <laughs> and then I also got these one gallon jars. You gotta have lots of jars when you're a homesteader. Everything goes in a glass jar. You gotta be able to see it. So overall, this is all the stuff that I got, guys. I, I'm, I'm really happy. 
I love Azure Standard. We've been using them for years and we will continue to keep using them. So if you ever need a company that sells good natural items and in bulk form with the different sizes that you like, this is the place to go. Even the packaging is environmentally friendly for the most part. They pack everything in these brown bags. It's compostable and that's perfect. I mean, you do see some items did come in their original packaging, but all the things that are from Azure, from their brand, all comes in this brown paper bag. And then they pack everything in just cardboard boxes. So most of these things are gonna be easily compostable and disposable. And so I like that. So Azure Standard, guys, check them out. We'll see you next time at Rowan Co. Farms.